Oh. Oh. Oh, I don't like this. Don't even think. What the hell? This is where you die. <laughs> Ooh, there goes my soul. What is up, everybody? My name is Velox. Today we are back again with another reaction video. It has been a while. Um, haven't said that in a while, actually. Um, been on the uploads, then I disappeared due to like uni work, catching up, and stuff like that. But yeah, I'm really excited to see what you guys have been cooking up and submitting in the Discord server, which you can join via the link below. I did actually react to Battington's video, but I lost the footage because it's on my laptop that I left around like a mate's place, so don't have access to that just yet, so it will go up in future. The only annoying thing about that video is the camera wasn't in focus for most of it. But the reaction's still there. It's not like it's a total blur. But anyways, let's let's actually begin this. <laughs> yes, we are back with like the double mic. Um, I obviously don't use this one, but it, it's just weird seeing up there because it's just in the corner of my eye, whereas there it's not in my field of view. So this is Daylight TV Missing Person Hijacking 61492. It is by Recorded Recollections, the Archive of Television. <laughs> Sorry. Um, <laughs> apparently, I've checked out some of the comments and people were like giving it a lot of praise like oh i genuinely thought this was real looks really good it's only two minutes long let's just jump into this okay hopefully this music isn't copyright i tried to check through um so hopefully we don't copyright on anything until tomorrow when we continue our program, so the windows logo I wish you a very pleasant good night and tomorrow there we go put the top and on. gentlemen our national anthem oh national anthem here we go USA 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 I hope I hear like the squawk I really wonder what's which direction it's gonna take us when we're looking at this oh oh that was that was out in the last scene near Green Bear Playground. The Missing. Oh dear. 32, entering his home after coming back from work. So people have just gone missing, okay. Could you imagine if that was just on TV, like just randomly you're just watching some sort of broadcast that just pops up. Oh, and he's the missing people of the day. Like top 10. Kind of looks like, kind of looks like Matthew Lillard there. If you were to like mirror his face or something. <laughs> Jason West, fifty-four, last seen Ex exiting. I can't see it with the static. Exiting something. Yeah, I can't make it out. So I, yeah. So what is this? So it's not like there's any real link between them. At least not that I can see. Like near a sewer entrance with. Fr oh, oh, we got the. Scribble text net. Oh. Oh. Oh, I don't like this. It's cool, it's cool. Big strange cave. This is really well done. Bottomless pit, do not go near. I'll try, man, I'll try. Oh. So that was just like a whole broadcast interruption. Okay, and that's it. I'm kind of sad that that's all we get. That was actually really good. But I wish there was like... I'm sure it's going to maybe be a series that gets built onto. But um, I'd love to see where that goes. So honestly, guys, if you if you know of the series or whatever, start dropping some more in the Discord server, which you can join on the link below if I haven't said it already because I can't remember. That Yeah, no, that was actually really enjoyable, that one. That was good. I... The way the face distorted was actually done really creepy. It wasn't just like a, I don't know, like, um, like an Uncanny Valley sort of thing that I do or like a Mandela catalog where it's just face stretched. It's like got a bit of like this graphic to it and it makes it a lot more disturbing. So really well done, really well done editing there. Um, I mean, visually very impressive as well. I think you really nailed that whole analog look as well, which I feel like a lot of people do struggle to pull off. So keep it up, honestly, keep it up. Okay, next up we have Fun Time Diagnostics. So I was really interested in this one. It's by Static, brilliant creator anyways. But I'm really interested to see what this is because 
I feel like we don't see enough of the fun time animatronics in VHS horror. I think, well, I think it's starting to become more prevalent now that people are picking up that it hasn't really been done as much. But I, I can't wait to see what this this really gets into. I, I, it's, I think it's going to be like maintenance on the animatronics, but the fun time versions rather than the classics or the unwitheds or whatever. So we'll have a look. Oh, we've got a description here. Recovered from an old robotics rental facility, this video was released to the, uh, the public during a Fazbear Entertainment Data Leak. We don't really know what it means. Well, let's find out what it means. Four minutes, let's do this. I guess I gotta document this as part of my contract, so here we go. Why does he sound like the animatronic? He's got like some voice synthesizer on or something. Sorry. Proximity sense. Yeah, so it's what I say. It's like the maintenance stuff. I like it. I like it. I like it. A. Proximity sensor slash grouping. He is glowing. He is shiny. I don't know, man. Tell you this job's driving me insane. Yeah, I mean, you're talking hey, to a camera hey, as well. This is gonna be simple. You have some sort of I have said this before, but I do think I, it's something that someone pointed out to me back during my early FNAF videos where they were kind of like, oh, the, the narration feels wrong. Like, especially considering, like, the whole YouTube scene wasn't a thing, the whole vlogger thing, like, where you're talking to a camera and document everything. You just kind of film it for yourself or to show someone in person if you kind of get what i mean it's kind of strange to like document over the camera so i recently if you haven't noticed i've used less voice actors and i've been more specific on like okay so if i need a voice actor it's gonna have this sort of impact i'm not just gonna chuck a voice actor in because it's gonna up the quality of the video for example i'm gonna use it when it actually it actually changes something it's gonna it's gonna form a narrative or whatever like that but um yeah, uh, sorry, just a little rant. Fancy voice commands to run your tests once you're in diagnostic mode, so... Here we go, okay. To say... <clears throat> Here we go. Open run Sesame. Command oh. gather underscore one zero zero five nine. Damn. Whoa! Oh. Damn Whoa! Is high he moved! Okay, what the hell? Should open... Yeah, okay, I was gonna say, did his hat just slip off? Open like... Close displaying a... Small blinking light of various colors. Mm, I wouldn't say various okay, colors, but green. it is there. Yeah, it's oh, just good. Oh, success. Perfect. Oh, Let nice. The... Brilliant. Reset command. Run reset to operation. Alrighty. I love the heavy, thuddy, thucky movements. Couldn't really find a word there to describe it. B. It's really good. Parental tracking slash 360 pivot. I think sound design is really important when it comes to, to videos. It's something I've really like zoned in on, um, especially with the like the lack of narration stuff. I've really been trying to like focus on my sound design, but this is brilliant. This is really good. This and visually it's impressive too, but it's static. I didn't think it needed saying. Run yep. command track wow, we're underscore gonna test. rotate underscore we're gonna test Bonnie as well. Or Bon Bon. Oh and a success surrendering. will be announced with a quote <laughs> <in> Chinese. <laughs> he just spit in. Nice. Pretty lively to me. Run cool. reset operation. Alright, on to the next one. Damn. Um oh dear. Voice mimic luring. Something tells me that's not for birthdays. What the hell is a vocal mimic? That's kind of what, what I just said, man. Yeah, yeah, basically, what? literally, just exactly what I said. Command so this is where things are probably going to get a bit thingy, bit spooky. Yep, and he's, he's not done with it. What the hell? Huh? What is going on? Huh? That was so cool. That was so sick. Bro had lasers coming out of his eyes. I think that was like his like facial scan. 
oh that and that sound that like grating so top look you see like the 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 rail thing that he's on which is where we see uh circus baby and sister location and she comes past and she gives us a nice little chat oh my eyes so yeah it's it's scanning him or his face okay parental figure identify from date so it has a database of people's parental figures so it's identify his oh my god no sorry this is so cool i know i'm stating the obvious forgive me but it's just it's so cool to see it like this hello oh and it's like his mum or something oh my god honey yep mom. yep it's yeah it's, it's mimicking what do you mean, what is this? You literally just read the command for voice mimicking, questioned it, so you clearly acknowledged that that's what it said, and now it's scanned you and it's doing your mum's voice. You're going, oh, what? how could this be? This is insane. This is not possible. No, 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 this isn't right. Please don't resist. What? Oh. What do you mean by Please that? Don't oh, well, this is where I you die. <laughs> Ooh, there goes my soul. Oh, I, I like how it said, please don't resist. And bro, genuinely, he didn't even bother trying to resist. I mean, he, he, he complied. He just questioned everything and didn't move. That's crazy. That was that was quite horrifying. My soul flew away for a second. I'm going to try and pause it when it, like, jumps out. Oh, my God. Oh, that's so aggressive. Jesus. Imagine a FNAF game where the jump scares are, like, just that aggressive i don't think many people would survive it'd be like fnaf in real life you die in the game you die in real life oh god that was a lot louder than i thought okay we got anything next storage oh he's gonna be in there we're just looking at his belly okay he's alive in there how even like Elizabeth, a child got um, crushed, didn't she? From the, the whole scooping mechanic. That's crazy though. He could just be bleeding out, which is a whole different situation. Uh, very dark. <laughs> That's really creepy. Test successful. Oh my God. So I'm assuming William set this up. So it's like he's testing the animatronics on... The maintenance people it was meant to do that that's why the code or like the command was on his sheet oh that's crazy and that's why he's recording it it all makes yeah it's all it's all adding up thank you for cute your cooperation yeah bro's just a victim to william that was really good but then again i expect none less from the wonderful static fantastic work man seriously seeing this by any chance keep it up that was that was good I don't think we've seen the fun time animatronics in, in, in a such a, I don't know, I was going to say a realistic way in how aggressive they would be, especially with like the moving face plates and stuff, like they're just, they're, da they're just hazards, they're just hazards. Okay, so last one we've got here is from Blue Crown Productions, this is called Last Shift, so interesting to see what this is, this one's five minutes, let's check this out. Okay, here All we right. go. So, oh, okay, so this already looks like a custom location or something. Sort of archive thing. Sorry, for, I know I talk a lot, but the, it's kind of like the purpose of these reaction videos. So I'll put the captions on. I think I forgot it for the last video. Sorry, I talk a lot. It is the purpose of a reaction video. If you want to check it out without me yapping over it, just go check it out on their channel. All the links will be in the description below. I just want to make it clear now. Um, but yeah, this, this looks like a custom location. It's very empty, though. So I'm interested to see if there's any mention of it being, like, a brand new location or if they're shutting down. Because I see no chairs, there's no party hats, no nothing. It's very bland. No, like, presents or gift boxes. It doesn't seem very decorated. They said since this restaurant is still being put together... Literally could have just waited one second more. I should have just... Okay, I'll shut up. I'll I shut up. It, so <laughs> no one breaks up. I've been told to just stay in my office and go huh? through all the decorations and check the old monitors i will say the vhs sound is a bit too loud i turn it down um 
only complaints so far and it's it's like constructive criticism is all it's really it looks nice it looks good the effects and and the the filter nice because i believe you're using um is it ntsc qt i think that's the name i hope i haven't butchered that and you use sliders to control how it looks and whatever and i think you've got it you've got it quite well done but it's just the the static sound is just way too loud there it is the office I saw the boarded up room on the left as well. That's quite cool. So this building was... Hang on a minute. This looks like FNAF 2, but it's the FNAF 1, like, design. The style of FNAF 1, but the layout of FNAF 2. I like Fred it. Bears, but they scrapped the old walls and remodeled yeah. a whole lot. Uh-huh. Okay, okay. Makes sense. So maybe it's just inspired by it, but it looks really cool. I do like seeing some custom locations. Uh, hello. Too oh, sorry, right. But I think someone broke in or something. I'm hearing noises from down the hall. Bro, you are the security guard. What do you mean? Do your job. Go defend the building. Do something about it. Go tell them to leave or call the police. Uh, okay. uh, yeah. Bye. Bye. Isn't that like the job? Or am I am I the one in the wrong bed? Uh okay, so I'm hearing noises from down there, but I'm not checking it out. I'm no. Just... No, you're not checking maybe out. Maybe try and get out before it it shows up. Oh, before it shows up, so you know it's an it. Great security right there. I see why the pay is low. Crap, they're coming. Oh no, they're coming. I don't know what's wrong with me today, guys. I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't know what's wrong with me. All right. So I have. Look, I'm no tired. I'm who, tired. All right. What the noise could be, but I'm. Going to try and get out of this building. Would you? So wouldn't you just assume it was a person? I don't know. Or maybe the wind's coming through or something. I don't know. You wouldn't. I guess no one would automatically go. It's the animatronics. So, but so you would just jump to it. It's a person. You wouldn't think about it. And I still can't go over the fact that this guy is meant to be a security or whatever. Okay. Or is he not security? Have I just missed a plot point because I was just talking so much? Sorry. But I swear he said he was security, he was watching over the building or something. Okay. I like the texture on the floor, it looks really cool. Not just the reflections, but it has like, um... This has got a PBR map. Oh, sorry man, okay. I won't talk then, sorry. Oh. Camera movements are good too. Oh, the fuck is that? I wonder. That's so weird. I, I will say, it does seem like Foxy's just kind of gliding. With like, just... Mm, mm, I feel like I'm not hearing the footsteps hit the floor. I thought Don't it take it in a in a bad way or anything. It is really good. In the building, yeah. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I get it now. Alright. So there isn't meant to be. That's why he's like... I gotta leave right now. And it's the withered, so... I'm sorry. I find it so funny that he was just like, Foxy's like right there. He's right behind him. And he just goes, Oh my god. I gotta leave right now. And then he turns around. Look at what he did. Just like sneak away. He's got to narrate it. He's like, he's like a vlogger. And that's like the vlogger like narration I was talking about before that I feel like is really overdone but doesn't fit what the actual scenario should be. Doesn't fit the time period and things like that. And I am completely guilty of this. I mean, like I've already said, I got told this in a comment, and that's why I'm trying to change up the way I do my um, my VHS videos. Whoa. Oh, God. Okay, uh, all right. Bloody hell. He just jumped in my face. Stay away. The texturing on that looks really good. It looks like Phantom Foxy rather than Withered Foxy, which is really cool. Hey. Oh, I, okay. It's really silent. I don't know why Foxy is just dead silent. I don't know if there was an error or you accidentally forgot to add the sounds. But they're still creepy. If anything, it's almost ghosty. You know, he's a phantom. He's he, If it is Phantom Foxy, that is. Um, he's a phantom, so he's like, he's not really there, but the camera's picking it up. He's like a... He's the visual for, like, the, um, the spirit of the child. It is a cool interpretation you could have on it. Whoa, whoa, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Chica, Why what happened to you? She's massive. Look like the ones from Fredbear's. Oh Why no. Why does it look like blood on this one? 
But that's blood. Whoa. I'm going to hide. It just sounds like Foxy's politely knocking. I think it needs a bit of a louder banging sound. He just sounds like he's just kind of going, Hello, are you in there? Please, I'm just outside. It feels way too polite for a massive robot dead child thing that's trying to kill you. Oh, we're just hiding. Okay, is he gonna make a phone call? Oh, okay, there's a there's a door there. Is he gonna break in with his light knocks? Way. <laughs> Alright. Alright. It's been a second since he stopped knocking. It's been one second, man. It's been one <laughs> I am enjoying this. I am enjoying this, but Is there a handle on the door? You just... Camera's acting up. Yeah. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. It looks like I'm close. That's cool. So I'm assuming maybe the model for the door didn't open or something. Or maybe it was just a part of the script. I don't know. But if it was the case that you couldn't, like, animate the door opening or something like that, it's that was a really creative um, way around that. And I always praise things like that. If you can't do something necessarily you, you to be creative enough to find a way around it and it have it fit within the story that's a round of applause right there from me Player. three two one Go. we're around two steps and he seems like he's already out of breath Go. oh dear come on come on oh Player. they're the same doors that i used it's cool to see okay They're even recolored like the one, like mine, because I I retextured Never them. Again. Never again. Damn. Oh, why does Fazbear Entertainment want these tapes recorded? Good question. Good question, Jeremy. Jeremy, you're lucky you didn't get your frontal lobe bitten off. Oh, puppet! I saw that. I saw that. That's cool. You know what? Despite the jokes that I've made and things like that, it's all lighthearted, and it and it really is. It was a good video. I, there's obviously things to improve upon, so I take what I've said as constructive criticism, and I really do look forward to seeing more from you in future. That was entertaining, nonetheless. So if it was entertaining with you know the things that were missing, slap those in there. You've got a banger, honestly. That was that was that was good. That was good. Also, I know this is really random, but I wanted to, I just want to show this off. Look how cool this is. Tell me that's not the coolest thing you've seen. That's what I thought. Okay, anyways, that was really random. I know, I just wanted to showcase it. I just, I just really like it. Anyways, um, thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, please remember to like, subscribe, and take care. Bye.